What is going on, guys? Mobile Carrier News here. And T-Mobile has this new, I wouldn't say a feature, more like this new thing that's going on with them. Um, as, the all, as we all know, prices and inflation is going up at a rapid pace for everything. And AT&T did announce that they are raising prices. And now, and after as soon as after that announcement got um, told by AT and T, T Mobile stepped up and say, "We're introducing a new thing called price slot guarantee." Now, what this basically means, and a lot of people are confused about this, it basically means that you're not gonna be they're they're not gonna raise prices for you even uh even if they did even if they did in the future, like you won't be raised at all because you'll be guaranteed locked in paying the same amount. Uh, of uh, of the service like if you have the magenta max and you pay 85 a month you won't pay 90 or 95 you'll be you'll stay on that for a long time now i'm not sure if that's actually true i'm not saying t-mobile is lying <clears throat> i'm saying as as the few as the future goes on with everything going up at a rapid and insane pace if t-mobile doesn't see itself making more profit off of off of the plans and the services like they normally do they're going to have to unfortunately raise your price on anything you're paying essential uh the the magenta the magenta max i do believe um they they might raise it in about one to two years i'm even i'm even hearing speculation that they might raise it this year this summer actually they might raise it this summer and to me that is that's actually kind of insane because Summer is usually the time where everything, um, where everything usually starts going off. People are shopping more, more money is being spent. Um, inflation is obviously off the high end right now, and just the thought of, like, just imagine your 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 cell phone bill shoots up to like five to ten more dollars, on top of everything else you got to pay for right now in this current time right now. It just, I think this would really hurt T-Mobile. I really hope they keep this price lock guarantee like they did back in 2015 with their uncontract where where they said where they were legitly they were legit. Well, this was when John Ledger was CEO of T-Mobile when they were actually serious and they said you all have no contract. You you can be with us for 30 days and then leave. And that was actually true in 2015. But for something like this totally completely different than a contract because this is about keeping your pr your current price plan because I'm pretty much paying the same amount, believe it or not. I'm, I'm on the get more unlimited plan and I actually am paying $85 a month because I have the, I have the, um, auto pay. I have it enabled. So I get $5 off on that. And I'm just hoping T-Mobile doesn't raise prices and actually keeps this price lock guarantee. I'm not too sure if T-Mobile can keep this long going for a while. I'm curious to see how T-Mobile can really pull this off because keep in mind, eventually they're going to have to actually raise all prices. Even though you were promised not to be raised in price, I feel like T-Mobile has to move forward because if they're not seeing profits as much as they want to or 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 the return on investment, they're going to raise your price and that might get customers to leave. Uh, but then I said, but then I'm starting to think, where could customers really go? Uh, now all three carriers are expensive. I think if customers really want the cheapest plan, to be honest, they might go to, um, they might go to maybe Verizon, their play more. They might go to AT&T's, um, elite or their lower end plan. I'm not too sure. It's just, I think T-Mobile is playing a really slippery slope here with, um, promising that you're not going to, you're not going to be raised on your, on your phone bill. Because we're responding back to AT and T because they're raising their prices. Surprisingly, there has been no word of Verizon actually raising prices. People are saying they are going to raise prices. There's no confirmation yet. At least that's as far as I've seen. And who knows what will happen? But I really hope T Mobile is, is um is serious about this guarantee because if they raise prices, it's just it's just going to make customers leave. And I'm not sure if they want to leave to to, um, to Verizon or AT&T. The fact that T-Mobile does have the largest 5G carry, uh, the 5G lead right now at the moment. Let me know what you guys think about this. Do you think T-Mobile is playing a very slippery, uh, a very like tricky game here? I think, I think it's like um, what do you call it? It's, um, uh, I think it's it's like a 50-50. T-Mobile might be able to pull this off and actually not raise your price. For maybe three years, that's my estimated guess, honestly. That's just me. 
or they might raise your price and they might lose customers i don't know let me know what you guys think about this hope you guys enjoy this video subscribe for more videos like this and i'll see you in the next one peace